hand is. Let's try it again. How about a few rounds of co- Come on, baby. These are crappy cards, that's why they're not in the deck. Your opponent goes first, that's fine. Ooh, nice. Wow, these are like some really bad cards. This is a good combo. If you play this card, and then you play this one, both of them double, so you got about plus 8, plus 8, so you got 16 right there. These two, plus 1 to each other, so 4 total. Uh, this guy I could probably get, get rid of, but I'll get rid of the fog. And there weather might be something good to hold on to, so I think we'll get rid of this guy. Wow, we are close combat heavy. Like, big time. And he wants to play that and draw some cards. Wow, we are seriously heavy on the, uh, the close combat here. All except one. Oh, might as well. Catapult. I do have the rain for that if I need it. And this allows me to draw cards as well. So maybe we just go the double double infantry here. Oh, he's probably got the same thing too. But what he doesn't have is I have the rain which will mess up with the siege. So I have to definitely play a lot more. Oh yeah, just keep playing your siege cards because they're only gonna go down to one. Swap with a card on the battlefield and return it to your hand. It's true. I could take that and be able to draw cards. Which might not be a bad situation. I'm gonna play this rain here. So instead of 14, it's only two. Oh, and then he clears it with that card. All right, all right. Well, since I pretty much am going to lose this, might as well get some cards out of this. I might as well, man. There we go, that's some pretty good cards. Tangible Fog, yep, just keep it going, buddy. Play on this, on his turn, on his side. And I'll draw two more cards from my deck. Yeah, man, I'm good. And he's just gonna keep playing cards. That's totally fine. So he only has four cards to play with. We have eight, plus probably an extra that we can draw. But I have a feeling he's going to draw a card. Um, he'll probably draw a card. Yep. He's got five to play with. But of course, we've got some weather options. I kind of want to try to win without having to use both of these guys. So let's see if we can potentially win this. I can use my hero ability, which is fine. That's fine. He wants to use that. That's cool. Still have to play something. Play this. But I also have the clear card as well, which I think I might actually play. Play the clear card, and then I'll use my leader ability, which is the fog, which his ranged is just gonna go, just gonna bite the dust. Nice. Pretty sure we're gonna win this round. 
got one card left. Opponent passed, yep, because he doesn't have anything good. So we'll be able to win this round. And we should automatically win the next round as well. We should draw a card, yep, there we go, nice. So let's go ahead and uh, throw these guys down. Oh yeah, we totally won. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do boom. Beat you by 34. There we go. Have a nice day, sir. Give me a good card. He really messed himself up by playing so many cards that first round and then not having the ability to draw cards so as you can see right there I was able to draw an extra four cards plus the one uh, that comes with playing the, the Northern Realms faction so I I drew five more cards than he did and that was the difference so work, my man's got, eh? not ask that. Brought him a bucket two crowns of and Ida Eman Epsivini whatever that is what kind of deck does that go into? Let me guess, Nilf Guardian. No? Really, a Scoia'tael deck? Really? That kind of sucks. That, that seriously, that that sucks. I thought that was gonna give me a pretty good card, but nope. All right, well we bought all the cards from him. Got a lump of bread today. Got a lump of bread today, you say? All right, let's save and then we'll oh! go check out this uh, quest line over here. Their asses whipped like an elven rad whore. You surprised? They tried to dance with a witcher. Where did he come from anyway? Well, how should I know? You so curious? Ask him yourself. Yeah, ask me. Right here. I like how they're just talking amongst themselves like I'm not around and I'm right here. Excuse me. Screw riding a horse because I want to just run. Want to run? So with some settings knocked down a notch, uh, we're at 38 frames, 38, 39, so not even cracking 40. And if you've seen the recent broadcasts during the week, you've noticed that I've spoken a lot about uh, the FPS in this game and how low I'm getting. But you gotta remember too that I'm running a... My graphics driver, my NVIDIA graphics driver, has been updated since November. So... Hungers turn this one pale. is a quest help an old feeble woman what's wrong to their night blasphemers pox take and profane the shrine to verna the merciful shrine's gotta be repaired else verna will take umbrage her cows will croak and kitties will be covered in warts and our dogs will get the mange you know for an old lady you got some big hooters just saying uh yeah i'll, I'll help you out warts and mange sounds dangerous fine i'll help you Getting 46 FPS in this little cutscene area here. Done. Pretty smooth. The gods have sent ye to me. Someone to repair their shrines from this day on. Look, already got a trade. I'm a witcher. Restoring traditional roadside structures in wood. Just not my specialty. Fighting evil. That's a witcher's calling. 
and vandals are worse than beasts. Fix the shrines if I come across them. Fine. I see any damaged shrines, I'll take care of them. Won't go out of my way though. Nothing's out of the way in these parts, and the gods will guide ye. Turn this one pale. Ten experience for standing up this statue. I'll probably end up going out of my way. Why not? What's going on, men. <laughs> you looking for, sir? Uh -huh. Checking out that old lady back there, me? or what? Ah, another merchant. I don't think we've been here. Buy in or just peruse him. Well, I'm looking to play some Gwent. Show me what you've got on offer. Ah, another map? First map? I don't think we have that, or do we? Uh Somebody had we had some maps. Oh, those are different ones. Uh, this guy, we have the third, so let's just purchase that. Um, you don't have any Gwent cards, but I will pay, play you at some Gwent. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. Why is it that only the merchants play, no one else? Alright, we'll just go with the same deck. Ooh, he's playing the Nilf Guardians, so... That faction also has some card draw, so he's probably going to be doing that. Nice, that combo is great. Um, get rid of you. God dang it. Good. Swap it again, and we get rain. So we don't have any card draw ourselves. Um, but if he puts something on my side of the field, I will take it with the decoy. Otherwise... Uh, we're screwed, kind of. We sit next to the car. That's a pretty good card, man. What is his hero? Is it, um... Torrental. Torrental Rain. So that's what I have. So I don't, I don't have any siege units except two. But... If he wants to even go that far. Uh, this isn't very good. Let's see if we can get him to bite on some of these. Okay, good. It would be nice if he played another one. That would be pretty good. Um, do I play it now? Or do I play something else? These two have to be played together. The same with those. I probably should have started it out with, like, maybe playing those, actually, but... Because this brings something back that has been dis put in the discard pile, so, like, after a round or two or whatever, I can go through there and pick what card I want. This gives a plus one, so she would be six instead of five. I guess we just play... The rain, I guess. That way he's got to play at least another card or two. Okay. I could play that and make him... play another card, then I would save. And if I play a card and he plays a card, then we're both going in with six, and then I can possibly draw another card. Even though I'm not going to get use out of this one. But I know he's going to have card draw, and that's what I want to save the decoy for. So I can take it on my side of the field, play it, and then potentially do something with it. I don't think I want to use my range on this yet. Just in case you know, he's got like maybe something that's has a nine or a ten in range. Uh, 
Now let's screw it. Let's just do it. Clear weather. Nice. Thought we totally won this round then. But it's good that you got rid of it. I'm okay with this. His was the rain, so he's got the siege on me. Um, I think I'm going to save those boys for the end. So I'll play these guys and possibly the siege cards. Oh, my opponent passed, eh? Okay. Uh, and I, I seriously, I have to play this because if it ends in a tie, he automatically gets the victory because that is part of the faction he's playing. That's one of his perks he gets. Any game that ends in a tie, he that it goes to him. So screw that. I have to play that. All right, five cards. He's gonna wreck my tribuches for sure. I know he's going to. Pretty sure he's going to play his hero power. But that could also ruin him. Um, let's play these first. Pikeman. Alright. This is going to go 8, so 16... He's got to play something to get rid of that. Pipe bond. Alright, I can bring back something. I could bring back possibly maybe something like a range card. Um, or maybe close combat. I don't have anything range, so we'll bring... Uh, we'll play close combat. But he's definitely going to use his hero ability, I'm sure. Uh... Ooh, you know what? I could actually take my thing back and play something else as well. Oh, no, I can't. Wow, really? You're not going to let me pick the card? That sucks. Well, then I'm just going to pass. There's no way you're going to get... 32 points. I don't think. Play the fog, which is fine. You can play your hero power, which is fine, but you still lose. Nice. Won by a crap ton. What uh, do we get? Selino Harpy. I imagine that's for the monster deck. Yep, that's for the monster deck. Ooh, what is the ability there? Agile. Uh, can be placed in close combat or range. That's uh, only a two. That's not that bad. Not that great, I should say. Right. Well, that's good that we're going through and we're beating these guys as we see fit and oh. are able to add to our card collection. It's always nice. Oh, is that the this fighting thing? Yep, that's just saying that this area is needs to work. Okay. Will you join the tournament? Hey, a bit of honest fist fighting to clear the lungs and bowels. Don't warn you, <laughs> Jordan can be fierce. Likes to bite. Get me? So, what? Well, oh, is this that quest? Uh. What are the rules? We mostly use fists, but no one looks as defeat, Jonah. Then I, I don't want to do that just yet. Some other time. Yeah, some I'll do it things. some other time. This is that fist, that fury. Easy. Not at all. It's the fury thing. Ah, what can you make me, blacksmith? Anything yeah. Good? 
Craft special order weapons too. Do politicians murder high class prostitutes? Cause. <laughs> Ah, more playing cards. But what do you got in stock? And I'll take a look. Make? Maybe pick something. We're kind of low on orange, by the way. Second map. Oh yeah, sure we're gonna need it. Got some diagrams here for some weapons. Um, crafting wise, what do you got? What can you make me? That eh, don't care. Junk. Why would I? Why would I want to make that? Uh, Twelve, thirteen. Viper sword. I have. That's not very good. That's not very good. Twenty-seven. Blacksmith journeyman. Uh, serpentine. Yeah. So you can't really make me anything. It's fine. Uh, we can play some cards if you want. Up for a few rounds of Gwent. It's been the card session. The first hour has just been me roaming, taking a couple steps, and playing uh, Gwent. And you know what? I'm okay with this because I'm having fun. Playing Northern Realms, the same deck as me. Trebuchet. That's a lot of trebuchets. Uh, I would get rid of this guy. Some ranged and... Huh. This will draw me cards, so I'm keeping him. I could get ri rid of one of these siege co uh, cards. Trebuchet or a Ballista. Because uh, I kind of want to keep these two. If I get a freaking fog, I'm going to be upset. Okay, good. Alright, so same rules apply. The same rules apply. Our hero power goes for the range. So, I've got three ranged, two siege, Three, oh, actually only two. Uh, but maybe I could get away with the range first. Because I have my, uh, my Biting Frost, which I can, uh, use. Uh, yeah. Oh, he's going to draw some cards. Well, guess what, sir? I'm going to draw some cards as well. I don't want to go all out with my range, though. So we'll play this, draw some cards, and then use the... Fighting Frost. Oh, we can swap Thaler. Oh, he's, we're just going to just draw cards all day. That's just what we're doing. We're just gonna draw some cards, that's all we're doing. Alright. Gonna be a pretty good first round here. Hmm. Yeah. My opponent passed. What a fool. I'm gonna play this and win then. Yeah, I'm gonna play it and win. Boom. So he's got nine cards, I've got nine cards, we've both both drew four cards. Oh yeah, we got our combo now. Sweet. Should I play that right out of the gate? Or should I go trebuchet here? Maybe save the biting frost. Go trebuchet. Let's see what you do. Oh yeah, you're going trebuchet too. We'll see how many cards he commits. Okay. So I can get rid of... I can use the range as well. Use the fog to get his range out of there. 
Uh, we'll play this, because I don't really care for that card. That's stupid. So, here's the issue. I could try to go all in on this turn, or this round, and try to win this round. Uh, but if he has, like, Fighting Frost, that's going to suck. But still, I don't think that that'll be too bad. Doesn't have anything with the Tribuchet. What do I have in, in this, by the way? I've got nothing but range, which is kind of kind of bad. But that might not be so bad. I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Two cards for one. Okay. Alright, so we're tied here. I could, of course, use Biting Frost. Uh, or I could go all in on this turn. Let's see what he does. Let's see if he uses his hero power yet or not. No, he's just gonna do. <sighs> I'm just worried about if he has, like, a Biting Frost. If, if he sees that there's 16 damage. 16 points in close combat and he's just going to play it. And then I could play the trebuchet if I if I wish and the range and then it's just whoever has more cards on the front line there. But I, I, I think it's it's we have to win this turn. If we don't win this turn then my god then the game's over. I hope this works, though. I hope playing this works. Yes, there we go. So they're placed from lowest to highest, so... Good. Um, I could just pass. See how how bad would this affect me if I were to play the rain card? I lose out on 17 points. He loses out on uh, 17, so he loses out on 17. I lose out on 17. So it's actually not that bad. But I'm afraid if he pass, if I pass and he plays, like maybe. The Biting Frost, and then he hero powers, then he could win. I don't know. Let's just pass. What card do you have left? Clear weather? Okay, good. Yep, I won. He had a weather card, but it was clear weather. So we stomped on that guy. Stomped on that guy. Harvorek Healer. Which faction do you belong to? Scoyatel? Choose one card from your pile and play it instantly. Nice. But too bad it's zero. At least the one in the Northern Realms faction is good. Alright, let's uh, enhance our weapons. Is there... oh yeah. Enhance the armor as well. Hammer away, hit that hammer. Okay. So we've played a lot of people in here. Um... okay. We played at least four matches of Gwent. While we're trying to go to our main quest here. Mm. Oh. It's pretty it's pretty close. What is this guy doing over here? Oh, you guys are just sitting on a bridge here. Which 
checking out the beat. Shoots to kill. What's going on, man? Good to see you again. How's your day going? Wonder what this uh, Peller's hut is going to be about. Uh oh. Uh -oh. 